yo, I hear you can do card tricks. Oh, yeah, why not? Why not show us a card trick? So I say, okay, here's a deck. Take them out, mix them up, pull out the four queens. So they take the deck, they can mix them up. Now if they're clever, they might want to do it like me. And mix it like that. Oh, if they're very clever, they might even do this. And that's it. So spectators mixed all the cards up however they wanted to do it, and they're going to pull up four queens. So there's one. Go through the pack. There's two, three, four queens. That's a excellent, well done. So you mix up the pack and you pulled out the four queens. So we've got the spades, we've got the hearts, we've got the clubs, and we've got the diamonds. Okay, I'll put the four queens just there. Give the cards a mix, because what we're going to do, I'm going to pull out a mystery card, and you're going to pull out a selection. Okay, so we do this and we just spread it along. I'm going to pull out this card here. That's going to be the mystery card, I won't touch that again. And you pull out any card you like, the spectator pulls out that one. And it doesn't matter if I see it, so the spectator's pulled out the three of clubs, uh, three of hearts, sorry. <coughs> so the three of hearts, I've got the four queens, got the three of hearts on there. So I've got the one, two, three, four, five cards, and the mystery card. Four queens, three of hearts, and the mystery card. So if I take this card and make it vanish, as I have, but I've only got four cards left. You're going to think, hang on, that card's in here. Wrong. I do actually have four cards. So, where's that card gone? So, if we take this queen here and place her on top of that mystery card, if we take this queen here, so that's the two red queens, we're going to place her just below. So, two red queens and a mystery card. Correct? Wrong. Because I have the two red queens here. And here I have a black queen, a black queen, and a mystery card, which just happens to be your three hearts. So, with that being done, let's gather up the cards. Right, so, and this one, we're going to use the three queens, so we'll get rid of this one because she's deaf. As you know, the queen of clubs is deaf. Let's get rid of her. Don't need her. So we've got to use these three queens, so we'll place them just there for the time being. And again, I want you to pick two selections. So, we'll pick out this one and this one. So if I'm not a problem, pick any card you like, does not matter. And they are the four and the five of diamonds. I wouldn't know that, that's just for them to know. Okay, so we'll come back to that in a minute. We take these three queens, and they're gonna whisper each other, so I'm gonna put these in here, which is your card, the five diamonds, stick that in there, and let the queens have a look at them all, so they all know what cards to look for later. So they've got that one. And then take this card, place that in there, let them all have a little look at that one. And there we go. So now they've uh, both of them cards, and now we're going to put them in the deck, and the queens are going to find them, just like women do. Now, actually, we've got the Queen of Hearts, we've got the Spades, and we've got the Diamonds. Okay, now if we put this card somewhere near the bottom, like that, and if we take the next card and place that sort of in the middle, like that, and cut the cards. Now the queens, if I do that and that, the queens have found your cards. And there's the three queens with two cards in the middle. And they are your selections. Four diamonds and the five diamonds. Ooh. Thank you very much. If you go around somebody's house and they say, can you do me a trick, yo? And you have no cards on, you have nothing. And you think, well, I could do you a card trick, but I have no cards. 
And they're saying, well, that's all right, I've got some in the drawer. Now, as a lot of people in the UK will know that Boswell Garage ain't exactly regular in all the shops and supermarkets around. You know, I think the only place I've ever found them is eBay, Amazon, and other specialist car companies. But it is really hard to find bicycle cars in shops. It's not like America, where they're in all the shops. So they go to the drawer and they pick out these. Now these are a load of crap from the Poundland. And this has happened to me, and I'm thinking, well, what can I do with these? They're probably the worst cards in the world. I know, and look at them, look at them jokers, isn't they terrible? And I don't even think these are bridge size, these are smaller than bridge. But yeah, so I hand you these cards and you think, well, okay, right, mix them up for me. So they mix up the cards. And uh, I say to them, right, okay, we do a just a simple trick. Pick a card, let it pick a card, and they pick out this one, King of Clubs. Okay, so you put it back in the deck, and you you lose it, and give it a little cut, and you say, right, what I'm going to do, I'm going to take a random card off the top, do that, and you're going to stab the card in. So stab the card in really deck where you think your card is, because it's in there somewhere. All right, so that's what I want you to do. So we would take this top card, which is just a random card, which is eight of clubs. All right, take the eight of clubs, and as I ripple down, just stab it in. And you'd be happy with that? They say, yeah. You say, right. These are the two cards that you stabbed them cards into. Okay, so this card, 10 of diamonds, that's not your card, is it? No. Seven of diamonds? That's not your card, is it? And it definitely weren't this eight of clubs, was it? Or was it? The king of clubs. And then that's quite good. They're all happy with that. And they think, well, show me another one. And you think, oh no, I've now got to do another trick with these horrible cards. So pick a card. I pick a card. Five of diamonds in this case. Just to get it back in. And lose it. Just like so. Give it a little bit of a mix, give it a couple of cuts. And I say to them, right, think of any number, any number between, you know, say, not too big because I don't want to be here all day, so say like 10 and 30. So they choose 17. So you think, okay, 17 then, okay, so you've got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. Okay, so the 17th card is that one. And we can do that. So we've got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. What was the name of your card? The Five of Diamonds. Okay, thank you very much. Just say that would do because I don't want to play with these cards for any much longer.